what's going on theme park fans how you all doing today is a very exciting day because we're going to dubai yes i know i can't even believe i'm saying that um it's coming a few days early because we were supposed to be going on friday uh today is wednesday at the time we're recording this so um i mean it's earlier and plus we're flying with emirates before we weren't flying with emirates we were flying with british airways so that's a bonus but um yeah i've just gotten past like security and like all the terminal queues and stuff because i thought i wouldn't vlog that because to be honest it's quite boring but um yeah so uh this vlog is going to be like how i travel and stuff give you a little insight on what it's like to fly with emirates uh which i'm really excited for um and yeah i'm just gonna sh share my travels with you and have great fun uh but yeah tonight we're off to the burj khalifa um uh, so that'll be a separate video and i can't i actually can't wait sorry if i'm stuttering a little bit i'm lost for words I'm, i actually can't believe i'm off to dubai but um yeah so i'm just gonna walk through duty free for a bit and um go to our gate because uh, we're flying about an hour so yeah i can't wait um see you there all right guys so just outside my gate right now it's um i think it's like 45 minutes till i board um so i'm just gonna wait around a little bit i'm just waiting for my mum to get a coffee but um yeah i'm right outside the gate and actually right over there is the emirates lounge um but <laughs> but um yeah i think that's just for like business class and first class people so unfortunately i can't go in there um i'll try and ask though um see if i can get like a sneak view but um yeah so i'm really excited sorry I, if i'm like stuttering and stuff i've already said this but like i'm very excited can't actually believe i'm off to dubai but uh yeah so i'll see you guys when i get uh, when i'm going through um my gate and um i'll see you on the flight all right guys so unfortunately this is only for business class and first class members but look at this a380 what a beauty wow look at that might do that as my thumbnail but wow emirates a380 one of my favorite planes that look airbus a380 love it all right so we are boarding our flight now on the airbus a380 not an a350 and a380 which i can't believe one of my favorite planes if not my favorite planes anyways um yeah face masks are mandatory so you need to wear a face mask while on plane so um on the plane should i say anyways but yeah we're boarding right now i actually can't wait for this um but um yeah all right i'll see you on the plane and i'll give you like a full review of like all the entertainment and stuff so yeah i'll see you then all right guys i don't know whether you can hear me but we're starting to push back right now luckily i got a window seat but um yeah um i'll do like a full in-depth like tour of the um in-flight entertainment when we're actually up in the sky but uh yeah so far from what i've seen it looks pretty good and i was lucky enough to get a window seat anyways because the person who we were actually sitting he was kind enough to let me sit here um but yeah i'll try and get some footage of the um takeoff uh and i can't wait i think the last time i went on an airplane was about three four year ago so um i'm very excited uh so i'm going to be doing like food reviews obviously entertainment reviews take off landing and just overall my review of the flight so um if you're flying with emirates or you just want to come along with the journey enjoy
moment. But um, I'm gonna give you a tour of some of the entertainment. At the mo, I'll try and find like what altitude we're at at the moment. But yeah, first time on a plane in three years. I actually can't believe it. Okay, so we can go on entertainment. We have movies, TV, podcast and audio, games, music. Dubai in the UAE and Ice TV Live. So let's just click on movies for an example. They have a lot of movies. They have like action, thrillers, drama, like animation, uh, all sorts of stuff. In fact, I want to see if they have my favorite movie. Oh, there it is. Scream. Love a good Scream movie. Yeah, I think I'll be watching that. really good entertainment on here. There's also like um, games and stuff. So like, there's like multiplayer so like you can play with the person next to you. Um, so yeah, really good. Action games, sports games, multiplayer, card. But yeah, there's like, the list goes on for like the games and stuff and this air aircraft is just unbelievable. Yeah, I think I'm gonna watch a few movies, um, edit my uh, YouTube video. I'm probably not supposed to be talking over this, but um, I'm gonna edit my YouTube video, um, watch some movies, maybe play a couple of games on my phone, uh, probably like Subway Surfers or something. Um, comment down below if you play Subway Surfers as well. But um, yeah, I already, I've literally only just taken off. My expectations have blown out the water. Um, there's a few care packages as well, but I'll show you them like when we. There's a few care packages, but I'll show you them like when uh, we're at cruising altitude. So yeah.
like five hours, like five and a half hours left until we um, reach Dubai. So yeah, I can't wait. That pastry is not very nice, so I'll try the yogurt. No. All right, guys. So the clip that I just filmed for about two hours ago. Um, I try to have a bit of a sleep, as you can see from the pillows. It didn't work out too well. Um, I have like a very bad headache. Well, it's not too bad. Touch wood, but like still, I've got a headache. But um, uh, it's lunchtime now. The time is well. My clock's changed on my phone. It's 3:38, but it isn't. It's probably like half one or something, uh, or quarter to two. So um, yeah, I'm gonna show you what I've got. So there was two options. I went for the chicken. Uh, there was the other option was like beef so you got like some like chicken curry there with like rice and then you got cheese and crackers here you got some uh butter you got a refreshment towel again you got i don't know what the heck that is it looks like some sort of caviar but obviously we're in economy so that wouldn't be caviar uh you got chocolate salted caramel delights um, which is there and then you got um, water which is in like this weird tub kind of weird but um, yeah you got um, a whole meat roll and you got the cutlery pack which is actually actually metal cutlery so yeah and I got my apple juice again because I love apple juice but um yeah, I'll do a review on it. Um, I'm not sure about the chicken curry though, because I'm quite a picky eater. So, um, I mean, I'll try my best. All this is quite picky for me, but um, yeah, I'll try my best. So yeah, I'll tell you after.
try to get as much good sleep as I could. I had about 45, 30 minutes. Not a great deal because uh, I didn't really get much sleep last night either. But uh, yeah, we're landing in about 10 minutes. Well, we're starting our descent in about 20, 10 minutes anyways. And if you look out the window, you can literally see nothing. I don't know whether that's sand or... I don't know, but you can literally see absolutely nothing. So um, yeah, I'm very excited, but we might do the Burj Khalifa on the last day just to like get used to stuff like our hotel and stuff um, for today. But um, yeah, I'll see you guys when we start landing. This um, local time in Dubai is half five. Um, also, yes, I know I need to update my background. That's the old logo. But, uh, but yeah, it's about half five in Dubai. So we're gonna start our descent. I think we're starting it now, actually, because there's an announcement. So um, yeah, I can't wait. And I'll like click to it when we're about to land. I'm so sorry, guys. I'm so tired. But um, yeah. I mean, the seats were comfortable, the entertainment was really good. I mean, it's like, it's unbelievable. Like, props to Emirates, and it's very warm. So, yeah, and we're in Dubai. Still can't forget that. Oh, I've been waiting for this holiday for so long. But uh, yeah, Dubai International Airport. Here we are, that's the A350, A380 even, that we've just been on. But wow, yeah. It's unbelievable. So now I think we're going to go to um, our, um, our hotel. Sorry guys, I'm a bit tired. But um, I think now we're going to go to our hotel, which is the Grand Hyatt Dubai. I'm um, really looking forward to it. It's massive, so I think I'll do a hotel tour. That's if I have time, obviously, because we've got uh, like lots of fun packed days. I'm thinking of doing um, IMG walls tomorrow, actually. But um, yeah, we, it's like actually dead in in here. It's actually dead. But yeah, there's no one here. It's crazy, but yeah, still can't believe we're actually in Dubai. And uh, yeah, I brought a, I bought a f uh, I've brought a few memory cards with me. I've brought batteries. I brought like the the handle. It's like a portable charger. It charges it for four hours, so that's good for theme parks, especially if I'm doing it like all day in the hot sun, which I'm looking forward to. My first ever theme park experience abroad, I think. Um, but yeah, I am really looking forward to it still can't believe I'm in Dubai and I'm probably gonna keep saying that throughout this video but yeah wow look it's actually dead no one's here so yeah um, we're gonna get through connections as it's called right there and I'll see you guys after all right so it turns out we don't have to go through connections that's just for departures where arrivals so we have to go on these lifts I mean Dubai is just a massive city I mean I'm, it's, I'm, it's outdone itself so far. I mean, it's already been like two seconds since I recorded that clip, but I've just got out of the lift. And wow, this airport is unbelievable. Still can't believe it. So yeah, I'll see you when we 
get out of the airport if I see something really cool that I have to put on the video I will but um, I'll see it in the next clip I guess because I don't know when that's going to be because this is smart gates I think it's called like where you do your passports and things so after I get through here I might vlog a bit more or I might wait until we actually like get outside of the, um, the airport all right guys so i've literally just walked in like i couldn't film in the airport or anything like that because there's a strict policy on um like filming and stuff all i have to say is wow as soon as i walked in this room wow and you're probably gonna get wild as well so without further ado let's do this welcome to the grand hyatt <laughs> I couldn't believe it neither. Wow. Um, yeah, beautiful hotel room. I wasn't even expecting it to be this nice. But wow, it's actually ginormous. It's like a suite, but we didn't book a suite. So imagine what the suite looks like. But this is, it's, wow. It's, it's got a full-size sofa in it. I mean, what kind of hotel room has a full-size sofa in it? But yeah, I'm absolutely shocked. I'm also absolutely tired. But um, we're going to walk around the hotel, see what there is to see. Um, that probably will be in a separate video. I'll probably put it in this video or I won't film it all. Um, but you might see it like from time to time in a couple of videos. But yeah, um, I can't wait. Dubai's going to be really fun. And um, yeah, this room's so nice. Alright guys, so we've had a change of clothes now um, because we're going to go like into the restaurant for something to eat. But let me just show you the centrepiece of this hotel. It's like a jungle, you can actually walk down there, which I'm going to do just so I can show you it. And there's a couple of shops around here. I think there's some downstairs as well, just underneath there. So far, this hotel has been really good. Apart from the fact that I can't recover my, my footage uh unfortunately but um i'll try my best just so i can edit a bit quicker you know because <clears throat> i want to get these videos out a bit quicker but yeah so far i'm loving it we've got a grand piano here are you allowed to play on it or i'm not gonna try it because dubai is very strict but yeah loving it All right, guys, so I just walked outside. Oh my God, it's 20 degrees. I think it might be just a bit higher than that, maybe 23. And it's dark. And I'm literally in the middle, like technically in the middle of a desert. Look at this at the front of the hotel. You get all the flags up there. Um, I'm just falling in love with this. I'm falling in love with Dubai itself. I'm I'm speechless. Emirates, Dubai, everything's just been amazing so far. And hopefully it continues that way. Um, but yeah, wow, you can just see the Burj Khalifa. I don't know whether the camera will pick it up, but it's just off in the distance. Just right there. I don't know whether my camera will pick it up, but yeah. Oh my God, there's, there's even wind, and the wind itself is warm. But yeah, this is the grand entrance to the Grand Hyatt right here look the grand hyatt dubai right there wow it's very warm <laughs> jesus christ but i'm loving it first time in a foreign country in about five years maybe but yeah i'm loving it i i'm i'm absolutely enjoying myself to the limit right here but yeah hopefully you guys are enjoying the video too um i'll vlog when we get in like meals and stuff but i'm enjoying being outside at the moment because it's not like this in the uk let me tell you but um yeah i don't know whether you can hear me because it's quite loud that fountain but wow dubai is such a beautiful place so beautiful there look It's just the scale of the hotel itself. I mean, it's crazy. Dubai, man, you've, you've outdone yourself. Like, 
Wow. Here we go then into the tropical jungles of the Grand Hyatt Hotel. Wow. Here we go. Again, I'm amazed by this hotel. There's like a little pond over here. Oh, there's a waterfall over there. I'll try and get that on film. Wow, I've heard there's even like an indoor pool, an indoor pool and an outdoor pool. And there's 15, oh no, I think there's 13 restaurants. What kind of hotel has 13 restaurants? It's like, it's like a shopping center in here. But yeah, I'm enjoying this little jungle walk right here with the little pond there. I think there's supposed to be fishes in it, but there's not. Oh yeah, here's one of the the restaurants. It's called Wax. Oh no, there's two of them actually. Wax and IZ. Don't know what that means, but here they are. Oh yeah, there's another outdoor bit. I think we're gonna go out there now. But wow, I'm impressed with this place so far, I've gotta tell you. All right, so here I am outside again. Um, wow. Very nice, this hotel. We've got a little centre, well, it's not really a centrepiece, but we've got this nice little pottery thing going on. Yeah, very nice. And then we've got some fountains down here. Again, I can't, uh, I'm gonna recommend this hotel to you if you are coming to Dubai because um, Yeah, it's so great uh, I mean just look at that And I haven't even exper fully experienced it yet. I've only been here about two hours You probably can't see me on the camera anymore um, but Yeah, I've only been here like two hours and yeah, look at it behind me the Grand Hyatt Grand Hyatt Dubai, I recommend it to you if you are coming. But yeah, it looks like there's a little swimming pool area with a couple of slides. Hmm. Yeah. I don't know what that is. What's that? Oh yeah, look at this swimming pool area right here. I don't know whether you can see it, but yeah, it's all little. And there's like this um, one for kids. So yeah. Oh yeah, I can't recommend this hotel enough. Wow. It's very warm when you come into Dubai. I mean, we booked it in the summer. But, um, I don't know why we did actually, but yeah. St still no exception. Still, still an experience if not a better experience. You can hear all the crickets. Can we go down here? I'm all right. I, oh my God, that scared me then. Oh, it's parrots, I think. Oh no, the peacocks. Oh, it's a peacock cage. I don't know whether you guys can see them, but um, it looks like a peacock cage. Oh, I'm gonna have a walk down here. Let's see what's down here, shall we? Yeah, this right behind me is a peacock. Oh God, that keeps scaring me. I don't see anyone else down here. I don't think we're supposed to be down here. Oh yeah, oh yeah, there is other people. But yeah, peacocks in a hotel? A peacock cage in a hotel? Yeah, there's one right behind me just there. Must be a thing here in Dubai, but yeah, look, there's pottery going on again, and then a nice bridge of the pool. Look at this pool! Oh, I'd love to jump in there right about now, but 20 degrees is just cool. It's a bit like this in December, so yeah. Oh, I love this hotel so far. 
and also the room is absolutely amazing but yeah look at this a pool wow Now all the crickets and stuff. Yeah, wow. Very nice. Yeah, the Grand Hyatt just up there. Grand Hyatt Dubai. There's a little cave over there, I just saw two people walking. So I'll see if I can if we can go in there. Oh it's so hot. It's so warm. It's actually very warm. Oh Jesus. Yeah, look at this. Caution, mind your head. Oh, it's a little bit of a cave in here. Yeah. Very nice thing we can walk back up this way. But yeah, very impressed. Very impressed. Um, tennis courts. Tennis courts up this way. Yeah, there's lots of little flies flying about and stuff. But yeah, if you come into Dubai, get yourself at the Grand Hyatt. Can't recommend it enough. I mean, so far from what I've seen, amazing. But I'm sure it'll, it has a few more surprises along the way. Um, we're gonna get something to eat. I think there's like a, an Italian restaurant which we're gonna go in. So yeah, can't wait for that. Wow, look at this. Got even got lights on the trees and everything. Massive hotel as well. Little bar there. Mm, can hear the train going or the monorail. Very nice hotel. There's a gym just over there. Nice gym. Got another little fountain here. It just keeps going on and on. Yeah, look. Another little fountain there. Oh, the red light's gone off of it. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Yeah, there's some more over here as well. These are colour changing. Yeah, look at these. Wow. Oh, there's a duck there. Hello. What's your name? <laughs> Hi, Jack. But yeah, um, brilliant hotel. Brilliant. Oh, there's a little waterfall feature just here. I don't know whether you can see it, but it's just behind that fountain there. It's just like on those rocks. Wow. It's actually amazing it smells like, it smells like chlorine that yeah look very nice I love it I really really do so we're going back inside now I think we're gonna go find a restaurant to eat at and yeah I'm very excited hopefully you guys are as well
All right, guys, so we're sat down at the Italian restaurant now. So you know what that means. It's time for Theo's food review. Here we have the pizza. And I'll get back to you after and tell you how it was. All right, so I'm finished. That's me done. Um, I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. That was actually an all right pizza, that. Um, got a lot of flavour to it. Very Italian, obviously, because we are in an Italian restaurant. One of 13 in this hotel. I still can't believe I'm saying that. But yeah, um, 8 out of 10 for this margarita Italian pizza. Yes, again, I'm very plain. Only, only margarita uh, do me. Um, but yeah, um, 8 out of 10. Not bad. Not bad. Alright guys, so that is going to wrap up today's video. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. I certainly have. Um, we've done Emirates today, we've done the hotel, we've done reviews, we've done food reviews, we've done all sorts. I've also taken you around the hotel for a little bit of a tour, so I hope that you enjoyed that. But yeah, um, make sure you stay around and like and subscribe because the next video is coming out probably in the next couple of days because I will be able to upload these videos in Dubai. So um, yeah, I've enjoyed this hotel so far, hopefully you have. and. I'll see you in the next one. Peace, guys.